If you are bored and have nothing to do, get ready because it's crafting time. Today's craft is a carton wallet. It is a cool and not too difficult to make craft. It is also very inexpensive as you might just have all the materials in your home or can buy in the store for a very low low price. But now, let's check out the materials. The first item you're gonna need is a carton box. This is the most important one as it will be the main composition of the wallet. It could be juice or milk. Next, you will need a pair of scissors. It is more than likely you'll find some lying around in your house, so just keep looking. You will also need glue. This one might be a little bit harder to find, but I can assure you you will find some. Last is a marker. If you can't find one, you can get one for cheap on the dollar store. Now's the time you've been waiting for, it's time for the crafting. First of all, you're gonna want to wash the carton properly so the previous contents are washed away. When you're done, make sure the carton is dry because you don't want soggy money, do you? The second step is cutting the carton by the half like it's shown above. You will see why in the next step. On this step, you're going to want to cut the square bottom of the box. On the step, you want to remove the plastic ring where the cap goes. Pro tip, you can use a knife if you're having a hard time pulling it out with your fingers. On step 5, you want to cut the irregularities on the top of the box. Now, align the outline that you printed and cut it from the description below. And make sure the marks in the outline are perfectly aligned with the holes on the carton. This will be the main body of your wallet. Now, with your marker, make guides based on what the outline indicates. You will need this to draw it later. Now using the guide marks that you made earlier, draw the outline on the carton with your marker.
Now, with your scissors, you want to cut the outline that you just made. Once you've cut off the figure, you want to fold along the guidelines. This will help so your wallet can open and close properly. This will be your last step. For step 11, glue the plastic ring back to the wallet and close it. Make sure you do it the way we're showing it right now. You don't want to make a mistake and have to do it again, do you? Once you do this, your wallet is complete and in goes your money. Did you like the video? Don't forget to hit that like button to let us know. If you want to see more of this craft, click the related tutorial button on the screen. If you want to see more in the future, just click that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.